Yowza, 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 the final Friday in January of 2014. Yeah, okay. February's coming. We'll find out if that little gopher or whatever he is sees his shadow and we have six more weeks of winter, but I wouldn't mind six more weeks like this. It was, it's cold. You don't have to shovel cold. Remember that. And at least we're prepared for it. We, we have some semblance of good sense here in the north. Two inches of snow shuts down Georgia. Thousands stranded in their cars overnight. Two inches of snow. I don't know if you've ever been to Georgia. I've, I spent some time in Atlanta many years ago, and it is a hip hop happening town. But once you get out of Atlanta, you're in Georgia. My God, they should just stop fighting the Civil War down there, and I don't know, maybe turn on the Weather Channel, or is that just too scientific? You know, you can't trust the scientists because they don't believe in God. I don't think praying helped you get out of your car, did it? Two inches of snow. What a bunch of wuss bunnies. And here's a question. Are you stupid? Now, I'm, I'm, I'm borderline, but I don't think I'm stupid. But evidently, the governor thinks we are just a bunch of yokels. A $55 rebate because the the state is over budget? Oh, I think the real term in this rebate is the word bait. Bait. Because it's an election year. Oh, imagine that. Good heavens, the governor's going to send us $55 In an election year, he's going to try and buy our vote. $55, that might fill up your gas tank. Remember that retroactive tax that the governor put in after he got there and we got screwed? That took a hell of a lot more than $55 away from us, didn't it? But no, we're supposed to forget all of that. It's election year. Time to throw everyone out. I don't care if we bring in Satan, but at least that would be the devil we know. And it's Super Bowl weekend, or excuse me, Super Game weekend, because we haven't bought the rights to say Super Bowl. Oops, sorry. It's the Bowl of Super. Whatever. It's a reason to have a good old party. It should start, I don't know, let's say midnight Saturday. So that you can get a lot of partying in, then watch the pregame show, a lot of partying in there, and then just have a super, super time. Remember, don't drink and drive, drink and stay put, make them fix you breakfast in the morning, and it doesn't much matter because the day after the Super Bowl is the most called off day in the whole year of working. So let's get to it. Why waste another minute? Let us pig out, let us pork out, let us Freak out to the best of our God-given ability for, yea, verily, the last Friday in January is underway. And you giata, 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 Oh, we out!